all you Conan Exile fans out there. It's Granny Gamester back with another chapter of my 3.0 gameplay. Now I am playing this blind, which means that I have not done any of the sorcery except for what I've learned so far in this playthrough. I did not do the test of client, nor did I view any videos uh, pertaining to how sorcery is done. So this is all a learning curve for me and I am having a blast with this. Yeah, it's so much fun. And everyone chimes in every once and again with uh, some comments on, but not telling me everything, but just kind of giving me little hints on what I could or couldn't do uh, to get a better grasp of how this sorcery works. So I appreciate that from all of you. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, so let's get going today. We are gonna set up our fast travel between our regular base, which is right here. And uh, here we are here in the jungle. I need to find the obelisk for the jungle. So we're gonna do that today. I've got Stratos ready. This is my base here. It's pretty plain and simple. I've got my three ghoulies already. But in here, I just have my workstations, uh, the ones that I need so far. There's a lot of resources in this area, so I'm pretty pleased about that, more than I thought. And then Bella is here. And then up here is my map room, which I'm going to need for the fast travel. I do not have the ability to do the transport yet, which I know is in uh, the Age of Sorcery. I just haven't got it yet and do not know how to use it. So this is our sorcery room. This is where all my sorcery is going to happen. I do have my little pad down there for ghoulies. So uh, yeah, I've got them already. I plan to get more to, to protect my base from a purge. And I will also have to update my building pieces because in this area, I'm likely to get a uh, level two purge. Uh, which is, you know, very capable of destroying this, the sandstone. I usually will start with the sandstone just to get the, the, you know, the feel of the base, how much I want to do. It doesn't take much materials, but it does take more to then change it to a bigger tier. So I'm taking Stratos. We're going to go find out where the obelisk is. I do know, but how to get there is another matter. Now, I don't like to take him across this tree because I'm going to fall for sure with the horse. So we're just going to walk across and let him follow us. Now, I am centrally located. That's why I chose this spot because it's really... This guy, he's just going to annoy me to no end here. Yeah. So down you go, Buster. So we need to go down here and then go to our left and that's going to bring me to the path. Oh, good. Stratos leveled up and there's our path right over there. Very plain to see. Yeah, I'm liking this area. I'm liking this area quite a bit. Never built in this area at all. I did do a build right where the obelisk is a long time ago. Well, let's grab this while we're here. Hold, Haunted One. For you, this park leads only to trouble. Your people dwell east of here in the swamps, but to cross the curse wall is dead. Understand the wall was built to power the bracelets, to give sorcerers power when far from home. But your betrayal forced our hands. Now the wall is a barrier, and only those with permission may pass. Your kind do not have permission. You are trapped within these lands. It was our ultimate defense against the treachery of your kind. Do not go east. Do not go east. All right, we're going east. <laughs> I'm in my second childhood. You tell me no, I, I, that says I've got to do it. So here we go. And we are going to avoid <laughs> as much as we can until maybe I don't have a choice and have to fight. But we are going to just run through this just to get to the obelisk. I'm 
thinking I know how to get there, but we don't know for certain, so... I think I just need to keep going down through the middle of this. Can I ride under that? Oh, sure I can. Alright, now I can't go that way. I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna go through there? Ooh, I can. Alright. Uh, I think? Is this the way? Oh, I think it might be. I think it might be. And, yep, we go right here. Um, okay. I think I go up around this way to get to it. Yeah, when I first went hunting for this obelisk, it was the last one that I had not found. I found the one that is up here. But I, I knew there was one more. But do you think I could find it? Oh my goodness, this took me forever to find. Because as you all know, I don't like to look things up unless I absolutely have to, if I'm absolutely stumped. And there it is. That is just awesome. Alright, so we're going to have to do the kitty in here because he's not going to leave us alone. Yeah, a lot of panthers in the jungle, as well as gorillas. Alright, so let's attune our bracelet. Awesome, now our fast travel is ready. So, this area is kind of cool. This is where I, I built one huge, huge castle. And uh, it's funny because I did a video on it and I got some complaints that it wasn't very nice because it blocked, it blocked it. Ooh, look at all the kitties from other players, but little did they know I was single player, so it didn't matter. <laughs> I could do it, you know? I wasn't hurting anyone, but it, it made for a beautiful area to build then. It was really quite pretty, and uh, it overlooked that whole section too. Yeah, very nice. All right, so now we need to head back to our base. We're gonna grab Bella. And we're going to go back to our original base. We're going to leave her there. Uh, I did bring plenty of materials. But if I need to get brimstone or any of those other things, um, it's going to be easy for me to fast travel back and forth. Now i got to remember that I can come through this little area here and then just go straight back all right now let's hope i can remember this i'm not bothered by too many apes so that's a pretty direct route So, uh, yes, when I fast travel, I do my map room from my home base, that's where I'm going to show up. So it's good that I've got this path that's pretty easy to follow to get back to my base. Yeah. Alright, so across we go. Just gotta remember my marker is... And that pile of stones right there that goes straight up in that big tree. Yeah, it takes a while to learn an area when you move into it. I'm sure you all know that. When you start building, you don't you don't quite know where everything is or how to get where you need to go. But it's, it's all the fun of this as you learn as you go along. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool game. Of course, I crow about it all the time. You guys probably get sick of listening to me. <laughs> but it's all because I've played for so many years and, uh, yeah. Not too many games like this one. And I am excited for Dune to come out. Yeah. So far, they don't have a date. But it does say that um, next year at some point. Of course. So that, that's pretty exciting. 
All right, so I have Stratos following me. Now I'm going to tell Bella to follow me. And she will follow me because Stratos is a horse to ride. So I am allowed one follower. All right, so I want to go... There's the unnamed city. That's the Shattered Springs. So that's where I want to go. So off we go. Get on my pony here. Whoop, 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 whoop. And there we are. Voila. We are home. So let me go back and place old Bella. And again, you know, easy peasy. If I need more brimstone, uh, you can get it underneath the water at Buccaneers Bay. There's lots of it there. But you cannot use a pick or anything. It's not in spires like it is here. So you only pick up one or two pieces at a time. So you don't get a lot and it's a lot of work to get it. But it is there. Whoa, we went right by it. Bella knew it. Look at her. She's like, you're going the wrong way. Right, yeah. Now the base in the jungle, I think I'm going to do with the same set as this. I think I'm going to keep it together. So here we are. I'm place you, Bella. I do not need you anymore. Thank you, old girl. We'll set you right there. Um, do I need anything from there? Uh, no, because I can, I can set up sacrificing right there. I'm right, right where there are some thralls, so I don't need to do that. So we are just going to head back. I have my map room up here. And I think the jungle is over here. Because it's the only one I have. Yeah, there we are. Right there. So we're going to go ahead and teleport back. And voila! There we are. Skip right by that little guy. So you really don't need the teleporter. If you don't want to do the sorcery, you don't have to. Uh, this is another way of being able to teleport. It's not exactly at your base, but hey, this is across the map I'm going. And this is fine for me. I don't mind this little jaunt, you know, from either direction. As long as you're relatively close, if you build relatively close to an obelisk, which I recommend you do when you're building a base, um, this just makes it easy peasy. Uh, this one is, of course, a little bit further away from my base than the one back to the west. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you guys. So now I can get started and finish up my base with uh, tier 2 build pieces. The ones that I have uh, back there are probably a tier 3. I'm not sure I would have to look that up, but I think the reinforced sandstone I don't think it's a tier three. I think it's a tier two. But we'll we'll double check that. Oh, pony. 
But this place has a lot of uh, nooks and crannies too, guys. Just what a great place, Bill. Uh, there's like little holes underneath the tree roots, like there, only they lead into another area. It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty cool. So here we are. Voila, just like that, we're back. So yeah, guys, setting up my fast travel between bases for this uh, playthrough. Yeah, awesome. So now we can continue on with our efforts here to get the Witch Queen. We need to get some gorillas and discover some more areas around here. Yeah, I got a lots to do, lots to do in here. There's a lot up in here, a lot down this way. So uh, yeah, guys, well, if you liked, give me the big old like, and if you would like to see more, just subscribe. And if you hit that little bell, you'll be notified when I post my next video. Well, all right, guys, thanks so much for watching, and until next time, GG out.